Hello folks, Simone Spack 33 Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of the Abyss, part number 83. On the last part, um, what were we doing last part? Well, I know we came to Mount Zalejo here through Doth, uh, through the cathedral, through that stupidly long passageway. Uh, we were chasing Spinoza. Uh, and he, he said he's going to help us out. There's a wing bottle. There's a... Uh, some new enemies here, so we gotta fight them. Come on, can I get this bat to like actually run into me? I wasn't like running away from him. There we go. Just trying to get him to fly into me. So we got flame bats. We got a golden bat. I feel like that's a unique enemy, like a like a rare one. He's got a lot of health, so probably. All right. Well. Dang it. Yeah, rending blast is always sick. Let's try to keep these enemies away from me here. This one got wrecked. Probably through spells. Alright, let's use some rending thrust into some rending blast. No, they're not recovering though. <laughs> That's not what I want to happen. I, I mixed up my arts a little bit. Not much though. I still love rending blast. I'm gonna die. Fotch! There's some steel here. Yeah, this isn't giving me like 254 health. Is that a tenth of my health? Probably. If, if it's not, nice, it's close to it. Alright, well, we gotta kill these guys here. I'm gonna save uh, my over limit for that golden bat. He's got way too much health. He deserves some uh, radiant howl. Is that what it is? Healing wind. I won't let you die. Is that what this move is? I keep forgetting the name of this word. And this, this move, yeah, it is radiant howl. Yeah, so let's see if Gold Bat gives us some uh, decent gald. I'm assuming he will. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> oh man, he's got wrecked. We used way too much TP in that fight, though. But oh well. Holy fudge, we've got 8,400 gold. Holy crap. Yeah, those gold bats are definitely a rare monster. Jade is good as ever. Oh, this is the cool... I forgot about this. This skit, uh, it plays when Jade uh, gets all of his abilities back. Uh, technically, he doesn't start with all of his spells when you... Um, when you like start with them, he doesn't know Thunder Lance and he doesn't know Infernal Prison, which I guess he's about to learn that you don't know he has it yet. But <laughs> anyway, uh, he doesn't start with those two, but this skit only plays when he finally gets all of his natural arts back. Level 50, I guess. Oh no. Well, he's level 50. He doesn't have Infernal Prison yet. Okay. Well, it plays at level 50 then, so I'm kind of wrong. Kind of right, kind of wrong. He is the highest level character still, though, because I I don't take him out too often. He's really good. All right. There's probably more treasure around here somewhere. Yeah. Cobalt chamber. Yeah, let's put down something. That's the blue ones, right? Yeah. Writing bullet thrust. Nah. No, the blue ones are best put on spells. Um. Oh, she could use one on heal. Drain magic. I don't. I don't use drain magic like, anymore. Down heal. No, but it's definitely best put on. I don't know. Spells you use a lot. Third alarms. There we go. So they can cast it more frequently. All right. So these are probably going to be regular flame bats. Oh, we got these uh, flare rails. They're like snails, but they're all fire and stuff. Watch. I'm kind of getting overwhelmed here. I should probably put Guy in as a second melee attacker. I have some healing wind. Because look at these. Like I'm getting hit by all these guys here. Oh, you know what though? We're gonna do this. Oh, is he? Oh yes, Mystic Cage. Oh man, good night, Field. Good night. You're all dead. Boom. Well, two of them are dead. 
This guy's almost dead. That did almost 9,000 damage to everybody. Almost over 9,000. So close. Oh, that guy just dodged a Holy Lance. That's not a good thing at all. We're dodging my moves. I gotta kill this guy before another arc gets cast. But it doesn't look like it's gonna happen. But that's gonna kill him. <laughs> Man, Jade's awesome. So good. Did she want to use the orange gel? I guess she's kind of running low. Bit. I mean, kind of. That's why I need those better recipes. But here's another Dothic seal door. Okay, Ion. If you would. Right. You collapse every time you open one of these doors. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize, but I'm worried about you. I'm sorry, Ion. No, I'm happy to be of use. Yeah, without him, we'd be screwed, so good thing Ion's with us. Too bad he doesn't fight with you. I mean, clearly he's too weak to fight with you. But it would be cool. Man, all that loading. I could have I cut that. Yeah, well, I talked through it, so that's not happening now. Ooh, a druid cloak? Do we have that? No, we don't. Alright, sweet. Man, it's some more, def slightly more defense. Yeah, we gotta put in, like, what they got Jade put in guy. Jade is, uh, too high level there. Actually, we'll take out Luke, too. Put in Anis. I'm gonna use guy. Because he's a lot easier to use <laughs> than most people. Alright. We got Tempest. We got... Moonlight Tempest. Is there any other skills I might be interested in? Well, Severing Wind's are really awesome. Nihil Blade Tempest. I think it's like Novlade Tempest. I don't know how you pronounce that. Nihil? He says it really fast. I don't know. Moonlight Tempest is good. Moonlight Demon's pretty good. Is that what it's called, by the way? Yeah. The one that's just that and Demon Fang? That one's a really solid one. It's really hot in here. Ion, are you okay? Yes. Thank you. Um, okay. Let's hurry up and take care of this place. W what is it, Colonel? Is it my cuteness? Uh, no matter. This isn't a place I'd like to linger around in either. Right. Let's take care of what we came here to do. Oh man, I know all the things that are going to be the things. I mean, obviously that's what you had to do. I'm glad the game didn't explain that's what you had to do for that puzzle. Like, thankfully. Uh, you do have to kill this guy, though. Because he's going to become a block. I'm going to look up what these guys are weak to. Honestly. Nothing. Okay. Uh, Anis is probably still on mage mode. Which isn't a good thing, because I need her up here. That's kind of the whole point I put her in the group. So, we need to fix that. <laughs> put her on 75, and then get her up there. Alright. Ooh! There we go. That's actually pretty sick. But probably not too practical. Severing Wind's awesome. That is, like, one of my favorite arts for Guy. Just because it's so quick and just hits everything around you it's really good oh I could have used um searing gale oh, well. wasn't thinking oh he only has he has a three hit combo I need to get him with add combo for sure like, that's the thing that just needs to happen I feel like I need to put another arcane art on him though because Kind of lame just having the two. There's some Crimson Riot. That was pretty sick. I don't know why I centered, but I did, so there we go. Yeah, Guy's awesome. I love using Guy. So much damage. So much. So quick. Yeah, I guess you only have one thingy, so I guess why not? There we go. Searing Gale. Searing Gale's really sick. Guy just has cool moves. Like, it's just established. 
I should be using more Tiger Blade, actually. Tiger Blade's awesome. Oh, man! Yeah, we need to put on another Mystic Art. Or, well, that would be cool. But we need to put on another Arcane Art. I don't use Crescent Strike too much. And to be honest, I don't really use a, a lot of these. A Tiger Blade, I like. We'll keep that on. Alright, well, I think we're going to put Beast on. We're going to put another one of his combination arts on. Yeah, hey, let's put on Moonlight Demon. <laughs> I mean, I could have just put on the one he just learned. Yeah. Nah. Nah. There's a mystic, not a mystic art. There's an art he gets later, arcane art that I really want. He doesn't have it yet. He will. And when he does, oh man, I'm using it all the time, like all the time. I think that's the next thing he learns. So, pretty excited for that. Did he have over limit last fight? I wasn't paying attention. There we go. Moonlight Demon is just perfect for setting up this Mystic Art. Because like, it doesn't knock the enemy away, so. Which is what you don't want to do with this Mystic Art. Because then you'll miss with it. And the Severing Wind would be really good here. I would have been good there. Oh, it's still going to be good here. Hit everybody around me. And I feel like these guys. I, what? I didn't use that. I, I went for Severing Wind. Come on. Demon Beast! There's no Demon Beast. Oh, I'm almost dead. Yeah, you can use that orange gel. Uh, guy has the dash ability and his agility is insane, so that's why he's moving around the field at like Mach 10 right now. And he's awesome, so there's that too. Oh, and I just been <laughs> blown through his TP like there's no tomorrow. I always do that with guys like well, guys like Guy, but like in Lo Lloyd 2 and Tales of Symphonia, I just blow through his TP. He just has so many cool moves, you just, you just want to do them. You just want to do these moves! Look how cool they are! Look how cool he is! Oh, this guy is really dead. Good night, Innocent Shine. It was nice knowing you, but now you're done, so. <laughs> okay, Cheer, take it easy. The slightest opening brings death. Holy fudge. Okay. <laughs> Don't cross her. Alright. Did I I cooked pizza, right? Yeah. I need to make the ones that give you better TP. That one. We need that one on. Make that more often. <laughs> All right, uh, where do I go from here? Is that where we want to go? I want to say it's not. I want to say you want to go up here first, because there's a puzzle here that involves killing enemies and like those block enemies, and then you got to push them down. So I think you want to go up here first. Why is this taking so long to load, man? The loading in this game is quite kind of ridiculous. Yeah, you te definitely want to do this. Okay. Oh, we got Overlimit again. Look at that. You just build up Overlimit so fast, guy. Like, it's kind of insane. There we go. Oh, I'm going to get the double hitter in here. Maybe on this? I don't think so. Ah, oh, we didn't. What we got on him anyway? Oh, I have her on Don't Use Overlimit. <laughs> Let's fix that. Yeah, but I probably should hold off on my stuff here. Alright, I need to get her to use something. Uh, Dual Dragon Surge will work. What? Do the thing! Shadow Tempest? There you go. Oh, this guy's in defenseless mode. Oh, well, now he's not, but... He would have got wrecked. Now he's just in down, more defense mode. Now he's getting Tempest. And now he's in. Alright, this is kind of where I had Void Tempest on. Maybe I should have kept that on. Void Tempest is pretty good. It's actually a uh, guy's steel move. Maybe I'll put that back on. I don't really use Beast too much. 
Beast is good. It's good for knocking enemies over. Sometimes you do want to knock enemies over. But that's only more so in boss fights. These are regular fights. You really don't care too much about knocking enemies over. Because they're not a big threat. Yeah, I'll probably take off Beast and put on uh, Void Tempest back on. Pff, okay, Natalia, you can wreck that guy if you want. There we go. Beef noodles. Because she used beef with them. We just got like 70 TP back or 80. Or we got a bunch. That wasn't too bad. Alright. So we'll, I always have Void Tempest, so I'm down. But we'll still put on Moonlight Demon. And now we got three Arcane Arts, so that's not bad. Four base. And center doesn't really count. It's technically a base, but it doesn't really count. Is that what I wanted to do? Yeah, I think that's what you want to do. Like, I hope. <laughs> I hope that's what you want to do. You might have to light those bridges first. Well, we're going to see, so... Wait just a hot second, and we're going to try to figure out this puzzle. Fire probably does nothing to these guys. Probably just ticks them off. Because they're all fire. But probably not. Fire probably stuns them for some dumb reason. Are we going to finish this place by this video? I hope so. I feel like there's not much to it. I feel like it's just this puzzle, and that's it. Uh, I think this is one of those statue guys that he thinks he's a bat because the game has some weird programming. Okay, what's going on here? <sighs> Can they go back to the original monster form? Do we want to do that? I don't think so. We're going to try hitting this up here. Now, we're going to fight this guy first. I feel like it's going to be one of these statues. Oh no, it's a flare rail. See, look. It was a bat on the map, but it definitely wasn't a bat. <laughs> so, whoops. <laughs> whoops, programming. No, oh, I'm... Dead. Yeah. Do I even have life bottles? Yeah, okay. Well, Tyr can use uh, Resurrection. Maybe she'll use Resurrection. We're just going to enjoy this little cinematic view of the fight until Tyr decides to bring me back to life. I don't want I don't want to use a thing. There we go. I should have overlimited earlier, but I didn't. Just what happens. Now these guys are all dead. Oh, we're getting two of them at least, I think. Oh yeah. That one's almost dead. Stop hurting me. And by me, I mean Anis, but technically my party, so. Oh, she learned Soaring. I love Soaring Blast. It's so useful. It's one of her arcane attacks, and it just hits in front of her. She jumps up and hits stuff and does damage. And it's so easy to link into combos and the Mystic Arts. Oh, I got Healing Window. That and that? Sweet. I love how Severing a Wind just sets you up for Dragon Tempest, too. It's just beautiful. This guy is just awesome to use. Because Dragon Tempest is definitely one of his best FOFs. Multi hit, wind, you know, all the good stuff. Man, if only he, if he had add combo right now, uh, these combos would just feel so much more fluent. But they're not. Alright. Can I hit this? From here. There we go. Okay, so... I didn't want to do that first. Okay. This is what you gotta do. We gotta break this guy. We gotta kill this guy down here first, then drop his buddy on him. Alright. I got it. I get how this game works. Alright. I ain't... Oh, dumb. Dumb, dumb. Alright. This guy is in defenseless mode, so he's about to get Void Tempest. A whole bunch. Man, I'm loving this defenselessness right now. Like, let me do so much damage to these guys. Like, he's gotta be close to death. Oh, man. I'll overlimit the next guy. But this guy is like almost dead. So there's no point. Just die? 
Alright, you Shadow Tempest on that guy. Like, I mean, I could have taken control of Anis, and then I could use uh, the other extension, Howling Dying Moon, but I'm not going to. So I don't want to. And because I'm running out of things to say, talk about, so. Let's end this fight. Let's end this video. I want to get out of this place. I feel like there's not much, like I said, left. Aw, I want to do some warm wrath. Oh, yeah, that's over limit. <laughs> Alright, this guy's dead. You're dead. Well, this probably isn't going to kill him because this guy has a ton of health, but he's going to get a bunch of damage done to him. He's almost dead. Talia might overlimit. Alright, use, um, Star Embrace. Like I said, Star Embrace, you just have to use. It doesn't have to even hit. You just use it, and then she Mystic Arts. It's a perfect setup. You're dead. Bam. What? Oh, because he's in defense mode. Or defenselessness mode. No match for us. And these noodles, man, are coming in clutch right now because I'm getting all the TP back. Alright, so push that there. <laughs> oh, man. So much fighting. Well, this is actually a good change of pace from all the story that was in the last video, so... It's not too bad. And this game is all about the fighting. I love the fighting in this game. It's the best part. It's the best part of most RPGs, to be honest. I feel like if it doesn't have a good combat system, I won't enjoy it too much. Because when it all boils down to it, that's where the gameplay is. Obviously, it's cool for an RPG to have a good story and whatnot, but like when it comes to player input, that's where it shines, right? So you gotta enjoy what you're doing. I gotta kill two more of these things. Maybe I'll just edit this out. <laughs> There's so many enemies. Alright. Come on, just die already. Just please die. <laughs> How much damage have I done to you? A lot. You're still not dead. There we go. I forgot I had Moonlight Tempest on, which is actually really good. It's actually really good for any time these guys go defenselessness. Oh, I still got that guy. I forgot he was alive. Oh, he's about to get nightmared. And probably flipped, because these guys seem to get flipped by any spell that hits them. Oh, nightmare didn't flip them. Oh, wow, I blocked and not going on the offensive with guy? What's this? Alright, he's dead. Ah, oh, I just missed. And I have no TP to do anything with. Alright, this guy's getting wrecked. This is Dragon Tempest. I could have Searing Wind or Searing Gale, but didn't have the TP for it. Is this guy dead? Like, just died. <laughs> Alright, hopefully that's the last enemy. I feel like it might be. Like I said, as long as I don't screw this up, so I did, and that would suck. But I feel like that is the end of this puzzle, the end of this place. Not much to it. I hope so. If I'm completely wrong, then I'm completely wrong. But I feel like that's the end, so... I know what is the end, though. Like, next save point. Like, I don't care if there's... <laughs> I don't even care if there's more to go. We're ending at the next save point, for sure. Because we're 25 minutes in now, so... I try to avoid all the enemies I can. Look at this floating bat. That's supposed to be a bat. <laughs> yeah, this game is a. Uh... You got this thing's mixed up there. There was a golem enemy up there. But he was flying. A little glitch. The system. Alright, we're ending it right here, guys. Thanks for watching. I've been Otis back 33 And next time, we're going to go through that door. And that's probably where the passage ring is. Till then, bye bye.